Marvel Comics, Thanos has taken down dozens of Marvel superheroes and prepares to unleash the same fury in the Avengers Infinity War. While the Avengers may have their hands full with Thanos, they may want to consider looking across the multiverse at some of the great DC comic heroes who could take Thanos down. See the super strong, super speedsters, and magicians from DC Comics who have the power to destroy Thanos once and for all. Before you watch, click subscribe. You'll join our notification squad and be the first to know of new content. And can you guess which movie is represented by these emoji? Stay tuned at the end to find out. Well, I believe in truth, but I'm also a big fan of justice. Superman and Supergirl When you're looking for someone for a fight, you just need to check out some of DC's most reliable performers. In this case, it's the powerful cousins from Krypton, Superman and Supergirl. Having nearly identical powers, it's hard to separate the two from one another as both would be able to stand up to Thanos in their own right. As Thanos attempted to use his Infinity Gauntlet, the two could throw their own gauntlet of powers at the Marvel villain. They could try to freeze him, set him on fire, and lift him up for a quick flight into outer space. Superman is no stranger to tough battles. Over the years, he's taken on the likes of Doomsday, Darkseid, and Antimatter, among others. Time and time again, Superman is able to defeat the most powerful enemies, and there's no doubt Thanos would join the list. Supergirl has been just as impressive, although she doesn't get as much credit as her cousin. It would be awesome to see the current live-action Superman and Supergirl characters step into a role in Marvel's Avengers. The two heroes could give the others a run for their money, and chances are the Marvel Universe has no kryptonite in it. Who are you? I'm the Flash. The who now? The fl Wait, do you not know who I am? The Flash. Imagine having the ability to defeat Thanos without laying a single finger on him. Well, with the proper strategy, the DC speedster, The Flash, could get the job done. The Flash is one of DC's greatest heroes and can do a lot more than just run fast. He harnesses his speed in all types of ways and can use just enough different tools from his arsenal to take Thanos out. The first step is using his super speed to capture the Infinity Gauntlet. Thanos wouldn't even see The Flash coming as he races around and removes the powerful gauntlet from his hand. Once the gauntlet is removed, the vulnerable Thanos would be open to some shots of speedster lightning launched at his chest. If the Flash does fail or needs to correct his mistakes, he has the ability to make a quick trip back in time to correct the mistakes and start the battle all over again. The end game would be the Flash's ability to pulsate his hands and literally put a stop to the heart of Thanos. Maybe that's why the MCU killed off Quicksilver and eliminated their only speedster. Come and get some ugly. Shazam! Can you imagine the uproar if Thanos gets defeated by a kid? This is exactly what would happen if Thanos ventured over to the world of DC to take on Shazam. The classic DC hero is your everyday boy named Billy. Billy is able to take the form of a fully grown hero who goes by the name Shazam. This is so cool! And all I had to do was say Shazam! When you have the power of six Greek gods, you probably feel godlike while in your suit. Shazam was originally known as Captain Marvel, but when Marvel introduced a hero by the very same name, things got a little bit complicated. Maybe by defeating Thanos, Shazam would earn the right to get his original namesake back again. Well, a little extra confidence can go a long way in defeating Thanos. Not only does Shazam have the confidence, but he has the skills to take on Thanos and anything thrown at him. Shazam can fly, uses his super strength on foes, and his long-lasting durability will help him fend off Thanos' attacks and keep coming back for more. Shazam doesn't get tired during battle and would give Thanos a run for his money. My name is John Jones. Martian Manhunter Thanos may have traveled to Earth from thousands of galaxies away, but his downfall could easily be at the hands of a resident from Earth's nearby neighbor, Mars. The Martian Manhunter is the only living thing from Mars after everyone else on the planet died off due to a deadly virus. First introduced in 1955, the character has been featured in several forms of media, including Supergirl. 
His time on Mars gave the hero some incredible abilities, and all of them could help take down Thanos with ease. Psychologically, the Manhunter can outsmart Thanos by using telepathy to read his mind and communicate with no verbal words. Naturally, Martian Manhunter has super strength and agility, but it takes more than that to defeat Thanos. How about shape-shifting and invisibility? Now we're talking. If Martian Manhunter wanted to, he could turn into Thanos and create the ultimate battle of Thanos versus Thanos. A little invisibility and the ability to pass through solid objects helps give Martian Manhunter the edge when when it comes to taking on Thanos. The battle would be tough, but Martian Manhunter's mix of powers is ideal for stopping the Mad Titan. Zatanna the female magician has been making her mark on comic books since the 1960s, and her extremely powerful magician skills have made her one of the main members of the Justice League Dark. Her mix of skills can easily be used to take down Thanos on her own and really throw the Marvel villain for a loop. And in an impressive move, Zatanna has the ability to erase the memory of others. Wiping out Thanos' memory could create an easy way to confuse him and leave him vulnerable. Confusion may cause Thanos to rage, but Zatanna has a solution to that as well. She can use mystical energy as a powerful weapon and also has the ability to manipulate visions of reality. Thanos' mind would be thrown for a loop as Zatanna took advantage and destroyed the villain for good. What we have here is a rare opportunity for me to cut loose and show you just how powerful I really am. Superman Prime If the normal Superman isn't enough to do the trick, then maybe Superman Prime could step in. Just as you thought Superman couldn't get more powerful and invulnerable, we were introduced to the futuristic version of the character. In the future, Superman loses everyone he loves due to old age. The sadness overcomes him and Superman leaves his heroic mantle behind to travel across multiple universes. He eventually settles in the core of the sun, recharging his powers and gaining new abilities during 15,000 years of hibernation. Superman Prime is unlike anything we've seen before in his comic book history. The character wears an all-gold suit, has gold skin, and even replaced his signature black hair with a solid gold style. Superman Prime has extreme strength and could probably outrun the Flash if the character was still alive at that point. After learning the secrets of the whole universe, defeating Thanos would be a piece of cake for the hero. And where are you going? To face Darkseid. Why are you so eager to fight? I have my reasons. Now stand aside. We can't let you go. Try to stop me. Orion. Thanos may be one of the most powerful villains in the Marvel Universe, but one of DC's most powerful villains is Darkseid. Turns out Darkseid has a son who has chosen to fight for good rather than evil, and his name is Orion. Orion turned a childhood of evil and anger into a mission to be a true hero. He has basically turned into the heroic version of Darkseid. His strength is pretty much unmatched across the DC Universe, and he's joined up with the Justice League on numerous occasions. Just like his father, Orion is immortal, giving him plenty of time to strategize and take on Thanos. Orion would be great in hand-to-hand -hand combat, but he may not need to with his ability to manipulate energy. His rapid healing helps fend off any attack, and when Orion gets angry, he sets off a berserker rage even Thanos wouldn't be able to handle. A battle between Orion and Thanos would be better set in space, or on a distant planet rather than on Earth. Both characters are larger than life and would destroy everything around them as they brawled. The only issue would be if Darkseid ever decided to team up with Thanos and create the ultimate supervillain duo. Get out of our way. Not an option, Superman. I've got my orders, legal and proper. Dude, Superman just told you to step aside. I heard him, ma'am. Not gonna happen. Captain Atom. A battle with Thanos seems a little too easy for a character like Captain Atom. Captain Atom has powers well beyond many other DC heroes. Captain Atom's true power all comes from his mind. He has the ability to create anything he wants with his mind. At one point, he even recreated a duplicate Earth. In the case of Thanos, Captain Atom could just make duplicates of the Infinity Gauntlet, hand them out to the Justice League, and call it a day. There are other approaches Captain Atom could take as well. His energy blast could blow Thanos into outer space and keep him from ever wanting to return to Earth again. The superhuman strength gives Captain Atom the ability to thwart off any attack and helps aid in his defense. Don't show me what could be or not be. 
Fate is a fickle thing. Dr. Fate. A hero with some magic on their own will help defeat Thanos and make him truly disappear. One of the DC heroes capable of this is Dr. Fate, not to be confused with Marvel's Doctor Strange. Doctor. Mr. Doctor. It's strange. Maybe. Who am I to judge? Dr. Fate has the ability to cast spells and use telekinesis. Toss in some flight and pyrokinesis to help round out his battle skills. Dr. Fate is undeniably strong, and he is invulnerable to attacks from others. While wearing his signature yellow helmet, Dr. Fate also has the ability to manipulate lightning and cause deadly strikes whenever needed. Flames, lightning, and magic can all mix to create a one-man wrecking machine against Thanos. Is this guy still bothering you? And there you have it! What hero do you think has the best chance of defeating Thanos? Do you think the DCEU should cross over with Marvel? Are there any heroes that we missed? Let us know in the comments section below! Don't forget to like this video, share it, and subscribe to Screen Rant on YouTube so you can stay up to date with our awesome videos. And the answer to our emoji quiz is… Thanks a whole bunch for watching!